Hey. Question, young. Should I smack the shit out of you? Or is hey, we grown ass <laughs> men? I'm right. asking you, gang. Do grown ass men get the dog shit smack, smacked out of them? Well, it's going through hand and shit like that. <laughs> hold on, hold on, bro. <laughs> after, hold on. After, Does that not, a threat? No, not for you. you. I'm just okay, saying, like, okay, but yeah, if, if you, you, because you giving out the image, like, damn, I can just smack the shit out of young. You feel me? But, but if you too, motherfucker, think about it. <laughs> That's, fucking that's be smacking me out here. Nah, but look, back to the West Night Woods. Folks on some like real gangster shit, like nigga, you I'm smoking your homie, nigga. This back to the niggas don't even watch the whole, like, watch my interviews, bro. Like, folks say he made a comment and, and apologized for on his platform. Folks, did Cuban Dial apologize on your platform? She broke it down and was asking my question, she, J Man. Please, could you just she ask had my, no could you reason. My, could you ask she my had my no reason to apologize. The, what was what was she apologizing for? When she broke it down, I wasn't disrespecting him. Like I'm singing a song. I really didn't. I really didn't. Oh, like, so you ain't hear her shit. Like she was never whooping like that. I just read. You know the, how the I internet gonna really, run with it. I, I told you. I just see the clips and shit. Like, like I never right. really watched the whole thing type shit. Yeah. You feel me? But I do remember, or he thinks she said some shit like smoking two gun type shit. But, I never. But I, did I ever tell you like? Smack the shit out of J Man, or did I tell you like you if you wanted you to go? No, you didn't say if you wanted to. What's the whole point, J Man? You said you should. You, this is your word. Listen. You said niggas, niggas be putting words in your mouth. We not doing that today. Okay. You said J Man, you should have smacked the fuck out of her. Or what's the whole point of me talking was if you really wanted to go viral, you could have smacked the smoking tooth out of her, J Man. Is this not what the fuck I said? You don't be nigga. You, you interview me. How's you not? Niggas spend every fucking thing, folks. That's the real fucking th the whole point of me saying that. Okay. But niggas just heard, just smack the fuck out of her. Because that's don't a, give a woman, young. I don't give a fuck about Cuban Dow. You feel me? It's so, many, it's so many in the that, that really said that shit, like, type shit. Like, I'm not, I'm not, it's not I'm look, on, going bro. around looking for that yeah, type shit. Niggas clipping that shit up, you know? How long we been dealing shit. with this shit, folks? Like, like, I, I seen the shit you, man. We've been dealing with no, this shit. Don't just so say it, don't like, just say it like, 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 we don't give a about it. I'm no, just saying, I'm just like, saying, it ain't you really. Saying, how long we been dealing with that shit, though? Type so, shit, yeah. Not that it, like, of course, my just hurt how Lil J felt about it. You see what I'm saying? Like, I heard Lil J just go off of DJ, you even said, like, why you even felt comfortable enough? And that's what be Calling me the goofiest nigga oh, yeah, in the hood. The goofiest, is crazy, we didn't even get to folks. that. The goofiest but, but we gonna finish, we gonna finish back to, we gonna go back to DJ U. But I yeah. fuck, I really, I fuck with DJ U. And folks was like, I be in that bitch kicking it before the interview and after the interview type shit. Folks stretched the, like, in the interview that he ain't went no trolling shit or he yeah, went yeah, being yeah. disrespectful in the DMs and everything. I know folks, you, he got his point across, yeah. yeah. We having a real grown man, man conversation, conversation. Yeah, for, for, for the interview to, to spin that focus on some super savage shit and I post the data. Come on, man, that shit weird, bro. Like, mm -hmm. stop yeah. that. Nah, I, I, get, I, get, I get the perspective of you, where you coming from and then it's almost, I get the perspective of where Lil J was coming from because DJ, you, you from Chicago, so you know, don't even say that shit on the internet. Don't yeah. let it come out your mouth and you know better. So it's almost like you whooping. You whooping. You whooping you. But it, DJ, it, but, you it whooping? Gotta, but it gotta be, it gotta be like, damn, either he fool fuck with young or young fuck with him. Break that down. He gotta he gotta fuck with you to say something about your dead homie. I'm break that down with No, you I'm saying just be like motherfucker, be like, why is you comfortable enough to just say that's why you ain't that. been saying it? You interviewed. J Main, butter all these niggas like why that's what they trying to spin like yeah yeah I think that but why niggas ain't be like like fool gotta really well even to think once oh my mama for if it was some any trolling shit for that shit like, come on bro stop that for and then I ain't no goofy to be trying to let the internet spin that shit off and be and send you off now you do with DJU stop and that, now bro. you want to do something to DJU on his platform is crazy stop that bro hmm now that's I crazy. really want to like really talk about this shit on his platform though so I'd be like I won't say no won't shit over, yeah yeah I, I yeah, get it, I know? get it nah I feel it. So how you feel about Lil J saying you the goofiest one, you the goofiest nigga from 63rd? Like, like basically he said out of everybody, you the goofiest.